Welcome back to our channel. We are the Mays family. Oh, no. Travels. <laughs> <laughs> Mays family travels. I'm Carrie. And I'm Shanika. And that was Kennedy. And Kennedy. <laughs> Kennedy. And we are at the Grand Palladium Resort in Riviera Maya. We are on our vacation. This is Kennedy's vacation. Her first. It's Mexico. Okay. Her first trip out of the country and we're having a great time we this is our second time at grand palladium uh, our first trip was to montego bay we decided to bring her here because it's such a great family friendly resort and there's so many great kids activities here so we made our way to the main pool of the Grand Palladium White Sands, which is one of four hotels here in Grand Palladium River Maya, Riviera Maya. You might as well call it just one name, but there's four different hotels. There's also a saltwater uh, swimming pool, but it is adults only. And since we are here with Kennedy, we had to pass, but we're gonna enjoy the main pool. Each one of the main pools in each of the different resorts has a swim up bar and it's also probably another bar you can go to if you want to get out of the water. But if you want to stay in the water, swim up and get you a drink. I definitely need to hang out at this pool because I can actually get to the swim up bar without having to actually swim. The water in this pool is definitely not, not nearly as deep as the other pool that, that we were at. I like this one better, I think. Beep, beep. I found you. What are you doing over here, Kennedy? You learning how to swim? <laughs> Why are you splashing so <laughs> Do you like this pool, Kennedy? Yeah. You want one at home? Yeah. I want a pool in a hot tub. A pool and a hot tub? Mommy? She was so disappointed that the other pool with the jets over there is not a hot tub. But we got to get us a hot tub. <laughs> So there's several different pools here at the Grand Palladium, but the two biggest ones are at the White Sands and Hotel and the Colonial. Now the Colonial Hotel has the uh, really, really big pool. It also has the kids pool where you'll find all the water slides. It's also really close to the beach. It's just, just a short walk to the beach and that's where you'll, where you'll find more people. But the White Sands pool um, is a little more low key, less people, the water's not as deep, so you can actually walk to the swim up bar if you're a shorty like myself um, and there's ample chairs with shade as well so you don't have to come down here and put down your towels extra early so just some key differences there and you can decide which one's best for you So the wildlife here are absolutely crazy. This is iguana. They all just jump on here and eat your leftover food. They've been chilling at the pool all day. Just getting up, eating up all the food. The squad has rolled up over here of uh, iguanas. These things are amazing, but they are everywhere. We've made it to one of the many restaurants here at the Grand Palladium. We're eating at El Dorado tonight, which is a steakhouse. But the thing about this is you have to reserve in advance. I would highly suggest you download the Grand Palladium app so you can reserve on the app. But if you try to step, step in, stand in line and reserve it, it may take several days. We had to book two days out just to get this reservation tonight. Cheers! Bing. I ate my food so fast, I forgot to tell y'all the steak, but here's a picture of the spinach salad and the cheesecake. I fell so hard because we just got through eating at El Dorado and my food was so good, I forgot to even show you all. I had the best ribeye ever. I did get the spinach and the cheesecake, it was a little mid, but that steak though, so good, it's good. Grand 
Palladium hosts lots of entertainment every night. Tonight there was a beach party for kids. Now there's an all-white beach party for the adults. And it's time to have some fun. Top of the morning, if you hadn't known by now, I love to get up early and enjoy the pool when there's nobody here except for me and the people that came and put out their towels early in the morning. But this entire pool is pretty much to moi at the moment. Except for those few people that are early drinkers. I might go join them at the bar. One of the great things about the Grand Palladium for kids is their awesome kids club. So we just dropped Kennedy off. She's gonna build some sand castles here. They have a great playground right outside of it and lots of things to do inside as well. So we're gonna let her have some fun and we're gonna go hang out by the pool. So the Grand Palladium has an amazing kids pool. There are tons of water slides. Little small water slides so kids can get on. But Kennedy was a big girl and she got on her biggest water slide today. So we accomplished something at least today on this trip. We've officially made it to this main pool and Kennedy, my friend, is loving being at a pool this size is absolutely <laughs> humongous. Where are you? I can feel you on my back. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> You're swimming on my back, yeah. I'm trying. <laughs> Kennedy, are you like swimming in the big pool? Nothing you know? Water, you know? Yeah, just blow it. Bro. Oh. There you go. <laughs> you got it. Oh, that's a good thing. <laughs> oh. What are you doing, girl? Oh. What happened back there? Yeah, let's get it out. What's that sound? Are you sleeping? What are you doing? What kind of cop is that? So tonight we have dinner reservations at Bahia y Braza, which is the Brazilian steakhouse here at the resort. I am so excited to try this. Once I saw that it, they had it here at the resort, I've been excited ever since. I'm ready to go try it. You guys, the moment has finally come. Kennedy's finally trying some coconut. She's been obsessed with coconut the whole time we've been here. She wanted me to buy a knife so I could cut open a coconut, a random coconut on the sidewalk. And now she's finally getting to try some this is coconut candy. At the... You don't like it? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down? Oh man, what a bummer. I was a steak. It was amazing. We just wrapped up our dinner at, at the Brazilian Steakhouse. It was so good. It definitely met all of my expectations. Um, they just kept coming with the meat and I was okay with that because it was so delicious. Everything that I ate was yummy and so good. We 
So one thing about the Grand Palladium White Sands, and actually this four resort thing, it is humongous. So we sent half of our family away on the cart, and the other half we are walking because we're going to take photos. But I will say, if you want a place where everything is very close, this might not be the one for you because everything here is very, very far. this trip we try to take advantage of the Grand Palladium great beaches but right now here in the Playa de Carmen Riviera Maya area there is a ton of sargasm as you can see over my shoulder I came out early this morning to take a look and they were cleaning and they had been cleaning for five hours and it still looks like this on the beach so needs to say we are probably not getting in the water here, just gonna enjoy the ocean, get our pictures in, and uh, hang out by the pool. But if, so if you're coming for beach pics, like we did, we just got done with a photo shoot. Check out some of these pictures. We had to take them facing the land and not the water, which was the original plan. So it looks kind of wonky, but that's what you got. Please, oh, no, What's happening here? Huh? What's happening here? We are trying to get the coconuts. Trying to get the coconuts. Yeah, we want coconut water. You want coconut water? <laughs> Have you ever had coconut water? Oh my god. Yeah, people, we have a new member of uh, the vlog today. Hey, everyone. So, if you didn't know, we are on a family vacation. Hello, hello. And this is my sister, and so she's the newest person on our vlog. Are you enjoying yourself in Mexico? I'm having a great time in Mexico. So we are on our way to dinner and there are several buffets. But the first one we went to in the white sand side was a bit smaller. So now we're going to the Kenaha side where the buffet is humongous. I would definitely suggest going to the Kenaha side to get some food. Here. The sports 
bar was amazing. All types of traditional American food at the sports bar. Make sure you come to Extra Time Sports Bar Lounge and you're here at the Grand Palladium. Well, we've had a blast at the Grand Palladium and this is it for us. So, is the Grand Palladium good or bad? I would definitely say it's good. It's well worth the money. Grand Palladium, great job. Everybody else, if you made it this far, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. Drop us a comment below if you got any questions. We'd love to get to know you. Peace.